Welcome back YouTube, my name is Nigel Schroeder and as you guys know I bring you guys finance information daily. So if that interests you make sure that you guys tune into the channel, like, comment, share, subscribe and get into these videos with us. So today we're going to be talking about another credit union. You guys know I'm always talking about Navy Federal Credit Union, however I felt like you know it was the time to start giving other credit unions um, a little bit more shine and talking about some of the other ones since I've kind of already gone through all the um, all the other uh, products with Navy Federal. I still do some more Navy Federal videos because I know you guys love them. Um, you know, I, there's always more content and more to be learned and more to be brought to the table. But <laughs> today we're going to be talking about a different credit union and we're going to be talking about Pen Fed Credit Union. And as you guys can see here, um, I kind of alluded to it in a live stream last night um, that we're going to be talking about this approval. If you look here, though, it says pending. Now, if you guys have followed the channel for a while, then you know that I applied with PenFed um, a while ago. Um, and it's been over a year now that I applied with PenFed. And then finally, I went ahead, put my pride to the side and said, you know what? I'm going to go ahead and open another account with them or try attempt to open another account with them. So, so um, today what we're going to be talking about um, is my new approval with them. Um, what my credit profile looked like to get the approval. Um, we're going to be talking about the sign up bonus. Um, as well as um, you know, the your ability to uh, use this card and make money off of this card, and why I personally think this is such a great card. So, um, the card that I went ahead and applied for was the Power Cash Rewards card through PinFed. Um, it is a 1.5% cash back card. Um, of course, for those of you who know me and know me well, um, you know one of the things that just sung to me on this particular card was the sign-up bonus. Um, the sign-up bonus on this card was probably the most um, attractive feature on this card. Because when you look at the card, you know, the standard APR on it, 14.99 to 17.99, that's nothing that's, you know, extremely... Um, extremely attractive for a credit union credit card um you know nothing extremely attractive for you know um a interest rate to be keeping into the future you know um with having other credit unions uh giving out cards with you know um 11 percent interest rates and nine percent um eight percent oh excuse me, all the way down to 6%, this 14.99, 15%, it's not so, um, you know, it's not so attractive. However, their promotional balance transfer rate for the first 12 months on this card is 0%. So again, the promotional rate for balance transfer on this card is 0%. So when you bring in a balance transfer to this card, um, from another card, you're going to be paying 0% interest on that balance transfer when you bring it over. So it's one of those like no brainers, like why would I not apply and get this particular um, card with this particular benefit where I'm getting 0% interest rate for the first 12 months and all I have to do is transfer my balance over from a different card. Now, the next thing was the $100 statement credit. Now, um, as far as PenFed goes, um, you know, funding your account um, and things of that nature can be relatively easy because you can fund it um, online, um, you know, over the phone with them. Over the phone, I will say, can be kind of a hassle um, because PenFed, um, when you have an account with them, they um, they take a while to answer the phone. Their customer service 
is great once they get on the phone they're they're very nice people um i will say they're a little more blunt than certain other um other banks and credit unions however they are you know relatively nice and um they are productive as far as solving your problems um you know and you may occasionally get someone with a language barrier however um you know besides that i honestly will say they have relatively good customer service especially compared to a year ago um, i remember calling them in 2019 to do a reconsideration and you're talking about being on the phone for hours just waiting this time i will say it probably took about 15 minutes um which is not horrible um you know it's not great either when you have other banks and credit unions that pick up like this um but you know for their staff compared to the size of their credit union um and that being what they have to offer it's not horrible um the statement credit for this you know um your sign up bonus here um you're getting a hundred dollar statement credit when you spend fifteen hundred dollars in 90 days so that is five hundred dollars a month um that is not a lot to be required to spend um you know it's a decent little sign up bonus for the amount that you have to spend a hundred dollars back on um fifteen hundred um you know so with doing that particular sign up bonus you know you're, you're getting a decent um percentage of your money back nothing grand um i'm gonna say it's around um you know six and a half seven percent somewhere in there um but it is a good sign up bonus for money that you more than likely typically spend um you don't really have to force spend to hit this sign up bonus um as well as if you get their um their honors advantage card um you're able to actually get two percent cash back on all your purchases instead of the one percent that's offered for everyone else now the grand thing that i'm sure you've all been waiting for to hear um is you know the credit limit on this card what is the credit limit um and that's one of those things that um you know i always tell you guys that credit limit isn't everything with credit cards but it is great to be able to get high limits so that you can in turn use them to invest and do other things excuse me as well as take advantage of having that high limit so when we're looking at this particular card um and what limit they approve me for um they approved me for uh 2500 if you uh can see there with the 17.99 which is the 18 percent um interest rate now two reasons why i'm not going to beat up on them on the interest rate or the um the credit limit is remember my credit profile has over 60 inquiries on equifax and that's who they're pulling from is equifax so with over 60 inquiries um it's lovely to even you know get approved so that's one of those things is we now know that they're not super inquiry sensitive as the inquiries get older when the inquiries were younger they were very inquiry sensitive about them and that was the reason for my original denial um, but now that they're older they're not as inquiry sensitive as well as with the limit um i currently had one of my i was using for the zero percent and taking advantage of that opportunity and by doing so um i forgot the that that card had a high utilization so typically when you have a high utilization card it's a boom instant denial so with six over 60 inquiries and a maxed out credit card they still approve the card yes they did approve it for the highest interest rate but you look like more of a risk so it would make sense to get the highest interest rate um, which isn't that much of a difference also from their lowest interest rate anyway um, you know, plus you get the 0% interest for 12 months. So you can always call and, um, negotiate your interest rate down at the end of that 12 months, um, as well as a $2,500 limit, which is still higher, um, than limits that I have with certain other, uh, financial institutions. So I'm not going to be set with it. I actually am pretty excited to get this card. Um, I think that it is a good option for 
those who like to bank with credit unions, um, you know, and for those who already have Navy Federal, um, this may be something kind of similar to your cash rewards card um, that you can kind of have as a backup card. It is a Visa card. Um, and, you know, it's something good to have in your wallet if you're not able to get into Navy Federal also um, or some of the other credit unions. So with that being said, thank you all for your time. Thank you all for watching. Peace out and I'll see you guys in the next video.